this is Rick Brandenburg for Turf Bugs and Rock and Roll. And I know a lot of you saying, Rick, you're wearing a button-up shirt. It's the first time we ever saw that. Did you just get home from church or something? And the answer is no. Uh, I do have a more extensive wardrobe than what you typically see in these videos. But a couple weeks ago, I, I posted a video and, and I talked about uh, the calls and questions that I get about pesticides. Uh, some of them perhaps not working as well as they used to and are we getting resistance, are we getting breakdown, what's going on. And after that video, a few of you followed up and said, Rick, you never really gave us much of an answer to those questions uh, as to what might be causing some of these things. I basically said, I don't think it's a real serious issue except in isolated locations. So, so here's the, the reality, here's what I need to tell you. Um, we don't understand all the reasons why sometimes pesticides work better and other times they don't work quite as well. Obviously, the intensity of the pest population, uh, the environmental conditions, the weather at the time of application, all those sorts of things can determine whether a product works better or works less. Here's what I do know. I do know that we have fewer products being developed right now, at least especially with uh, insecticide. I know that the cost of developing these products goes higher and higher because of just the cost of doing the science, the regulatory hoops that companies have to jump through. And I know that we really need to be looking at product stewardship. Product stewardship is also a component that if you look at the, that the inputs into that also really uh, have an impact on performance. Because if you use a product judiciously, you use it under right conditions, you use it under proper uh, stages of the insect, and you don't always stick with the same product year after year after year after year, especially in warm climates like in tropical areas where you may be applying these products multiple times. Sometimes, and I know uh, you may not want to hear this, some of the, the manufacturers of the products may not want to hear this, but sometimes you need to give them a break and rotate in a different product to let whatever's taking place in the soil, let whatever's going on with products and their performance, to give it a little bit of break and, and rotate through. Uh, that's just good product stewardship. And I think long term, if we do those sorts of things, you'll see that we have fewer problems with products not working as well. So anyway, hope that helps a little bit. This always keep in mind product stewardship. We don't have a lot of new products coming in, replacing the old ones. And the very characteristics of product stewardship, of rotation of products, using them in a timely manner, these also help reduce the likelihood of products not performing as well. Look forward to talking with you again soon. We'll have another button-up shirt on, maybe. See you later.